Welcome back to another episode of the Casey Campbell podcast. Casey Campbell with you, of course. And we are pleased to be joined by Tom Hesser. We found him. Uh, <laughs> yes, we did find him. Of course, uh, it was announced yesterday that he will be returning to the Arkham Menard series um, for the first time since, uh, I believe, 26, uh, 2015, <laughs> I want to say. Uh, yeah. So, well, first off, Tom, welcome back to Arca. Welcome back to uh, welcome back to interviews, and uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. How's it going, man? Doing great, man. Thanks, uh, thanks for having me, Casey. It's uh, excited to run these couple races with uh, Billy's team, Victory Motorsports, next year. It's definitely been a little while. Um, you know, I really haven't been to the track hardly at all, but you know, really, really, really looking forward to it. So, a lot of people are wondering when it was announced yesterday. I'm like. Oh, there, there's, it's something that, uh, uh, that didn't expect that to appear into my inbox, but, uh, <laughs> uh yeah, it's a, uh, you're back. You wanted to, how did this all come together? Uh, let me ask that. Yeah, I guess it was the end of September, beginning of October, whatever it was, but I think around the time the schedule was released and, you know, obviously I still get all the notifications and everything and I follow what's going on in, in the sport and watch a lot. Um, and I saw Indianapolis, you know, IRP or, or um, it got back on the schedule. I said, man, I'd really love to go there again. And uh, so I called Billy, we started talking and you know, kind of jokingly said, man, we, we probably ought to run a couple other ones first because it's been a little while. And, um, and we figured it out, put a deal together and uh, we're gonna come back and run a few races. Yeah, of course, they, you know, they actually renamed it IRP again. So, oh, see, look, that's how that's how long it's been since well, I. Thing, you know what? If you ask, uh, of course, uh, my good friend and colleague Garth Allen of Racing News now, who's from that area, he always yeah. used to call it IRP. So it was, it's always been IRP to me because you know we spent a lot of time there, um, racing USAC midgets and sprint cars uh, there. You know, back uh, you know a long time ago now. So to me, it was it was always IRP, and it always will be. <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah, it's like. Uh, I think there's actual shirts that say, I still call it IRP. Um, uh -huh. Yeah, I think they, they have those when they have the SRS race. But yeah, anyway, talk about the races that you're going to run. Yeah, so we're going to go to uh, Berlin, uh, Elko, and then uh, IRP, which, um, you know, are three places. I mean, it's been a while, but three places that we always had a lot of success, really comfortable at. I think if I was going to look at the schedule and say, man, those are three that I think uh, I could be comfortable going back and you know, knocking some rust off, you know, hopefully pretty quickly. Those would be the three I'd pick and it, and it worked out that way. And uh, obviously, you know, the great relationship I have with Billy and, you know, his family and team, you know, been in touch pretty regularly over the years, uh, you know, since we left the, the garage area. So it's, uh, it seems like a great fit. So talk to everybody about what you've been up to. Yeah. Um, so we left the garage full time in, in 2016. Um, we had one child. And now we have four boys, uh, my, my wife, Megan, and I. So we've got um, just raising our family in, in South Jersey. And then I'm in the car business, uh, car dealership in Northeast Philadelphia. It, um, it's where I am every day. And uh, so just been working and, and um, you know, playing with my kids. So it's, it's been, a great, uh, been a great time. So I know, are, are, have, you talked to your, are, have you talked to your kids about... Uh... <laughs> um, what do they think about daddy going back and racing? I don't think they really know. And, you know, it's funny. Like, I, I don't really have that much racing stuff left in the house. And it's kind of been further pushed out more as I have more kids. Um, but it's, uh, it's different. You know, when I was young, I grew up going to the racetrack with my dad. And, you know, when he was a sports car racer in, in IMSA. And, and that's, that's what I did. So I was really exposed to that at, at his young age. And, and that's what I always wanted to pursue, you know, when I was younger. Um, fortunately or unfortunately, you know, my, my kids, you know, they've been to a couple races for sure, but it's not, you know, they, they certainly haven't had the same experience that I did. Um, but I think they'll be pretty darn excited. Um, and I'll try to get them into at least two of these three and should be pretty cool to have them around. Yeah, of course, uh, going, uh, I think Berlin would be the first race that you run, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Uh, What's it going to be like to head back in there? When was the last time you put on a helmet and fire suit? Cool. Uh, when I left the racetrack at Indy in October of 18, and the time before that was like eight months. So it's, uh, um, I really, and I, and I honestly, I've been to, I went to 
a World Outlaw race to watch at Bridgeport uh, last summer. And I went to the Daytona test in 2020. And that's really been the extent of my racing exposure in person. Um, I mean, obviously I follow and I watch all the time and, you know, talk to all my friends and, you know, uh, people that I've kept relationships with, you know, over the years. Um, but no, my, um, you know, I had to put on a suit the other day and it's still, you know, mostly fit. And, uh, you know, so but my wife was like, why are you wearing a fire suit? Oh, don't worry about it. Babe. There's nothing going on. <laughs> <laughs> why did you first tell her about that? Well, I've kind of been hinting at it and um, she was kind of blowing me off a little bit. Um, and then I, I kind of really fully, you know, we talked about it, I don't know, a couple months ago. And uh, she's always extremely supportive. And, uh, you know, I think both of us are, you know, uh, supportive of each other and whatever their passions might be. So, um, so it's great. Yeah. So that. And I think all my gear is like outdated. So that kind of sucks. I mean, I'm going to have to go <laughs> out of like SFI and all that. So, you, you know, that's something that I never experienced. Helmet and all that. Yeah. Because. Oh, yeah. Happened. Like I never, that was never a thing before because it was the always last, current. The thing is, the last time you were left, uh, there's been some brand changes and all that. Of course, now Menards is there. Of course, yeah. you have the because you, you still have fire suits with the old logo on it. Of course, the new logo has a, uh, you know, the I think yeah. bright yellow. And I don't know if they have the box, but it's kind of like that's kind of like there. But yeah, you have to go get a new fire suit. You have to go get your new seat, your seat fitted, and all that. So oh my gosh, I know I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to you know hit Billy up for a suit or something. <laughs> <laughs> that'll, that'll be fun. That'll be fun. But yeah. yeah. Um, if you get if the thing is, if you raced all these three races, uh, will we see more of you? Do you think you might try this? And like, I don't know if you, I don't think you'll go full time again, but do you think you might do some, you know, more races here and there? I mean, I, I would like to. I mean, I've missed it a lot for sure. Um, and then so busy at work and with my family that, you know, I'm just in a different part of my life where I'm so removed from that weekly, you know, going to the racing, uh, going to the races. But who the heck knows? I mean, I'll never say, you know, never to anything. Um, I couldn't see myself going back racing full time at, at this, you know, stage of my life and, and where I am. But um, who knows? We go back and we run really well. You know, it could be some temptation. <laughs> I, mean, it, I mean, it happened to AJ Allmendinger. He was only running yeah. full time and now he's running full time. So you never yeah. know. We'll you never that. know. Never yeah. know. Yeah, obviously, you know, looking at, you know, three short track races and three races at three tracks, of course, Berlin's on the west side of the state where I'm from in Michigan. Yep. Uh, what's it going to be like to go back there and, and run there? So Berlin is always a, a really cool place. You know, I, I'm super far from home, obviously, from being from New Jersey, but, you know, I raced uh USAC Midget there a couple times, um, raced a Super Modified there once and um and then the arca car a bunch of times and uh you know i think we got we got a pole there and you know a good bit of top fives and laps led and some top tens so it's always was a good track for us it's you know it's pretty abrasive hard on tires and uh you know kind of something i always liked um so you know i expect it should be pretty cool yeah for sure all right tom hessard thank you so much for coming on and talking with us and uh, we look forward to seeing you out on the track back again in a helmet fire suit back out in uh, back out of Berlin and Elko and uh, and IRP this summer. Yeah, cool, man. Well, thanks so much. Great talking to you. And uh, you know, look forward to seeing everyone this summer. Thank you.